Hello everybody, we're back. Hello everybody, we're back with another Dragon Heart. We, I think this is for you the last Dragon Heart. We're not gonna watch the second one. No, the the third one kind of ru probably ruins the second one. Yeah, man, and the fourth. So we're talking about the fourth Dragon Heart movie, the battle for the fire, fire heart, fire heart. And or the heart fire. In this movie. Battle for the heart fire. Yeah, this is probably definitely the worst of the series. <laughs> I, I, we haven't seen the second one, but out of the four we watched, this is definitely the worst. Um, the just... budget is really low. They're supposed to have this great big army, but it's only like 15 people across the way. And he's supposed to have this huge army. Um, and it's like a tiny little encampment. Right. And so basically, if you saw the third one, this is based upon the twins, uh, the mom... The woman with the bow and arrow, and the third one has twins, and um, they have like dragon scales on. Them. Right, they have dragon scales, and the problem is the the daughter has dragon scales on her face. So everybody considers her to be evil, and his dragon scales are on his back where he can't see them. And then supposedly the son of the of the twins. Oh, I kind of ruined it, didn't I? The twin, the uh, the heroes of the third one had a son. And he ran away from being a king because he didn't like dragons. Yeah. I can't remember why. Because the, because his dad didn't raise him as much as he did the dragon. Okay, yeah. And so, also, one of the dra the dragon that was bonded to his mother got struck by lightning and died. And so his mom, his mo or his mom died. Which right. is kind of silly because I'm just like, you watch that and then you watch the, the third one. It's just like, ew, well, um, yeah. hmm. So, right. <clears throat> Anyways... So they later the two siblings fight, and then uh, I'm not give too much away at this beginning. And then, but the budget's really bad. The acting is the acting's not too bad, no. but it's just like the script was pretty bad. Yeah, the script was really bad. Like the so, actors were okay, but the script was pretty bad. Right. So I would say for me, this is a no recommendation. Just skip it and go to the fifth one yeah, because yeah, the you... fifth one has no correlation with the fourth one. Yeah, just like, don't worry about it. It's not good at all. Right. It's, it's like, there's so many points where, like, someone could do something, but they don't because right. of something in the script. And I'm just like, you had, like, a full ten seconds to react. Right. So, yeah. So, now we're going to talk <coughs> about spoilers. So, that's our review. We both mm -hmm. give it a thumbs down. No recommend. But if you want it's, the spoilers part, we're going to do it now. Yeah. So, basically, I still don't remember the names of these characters. So the girl with the, the scale-faced girl, mm -hmm. um, she's, she's in, she has pyrokinesis. <coughs> she's able to control fire. Yes, and so she can make she can't create it, but she can control it. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, okay, that's pretty cool. And then during the movie, you see how useless it really is yes. because she doesn't do anything right. with it. Okay, we'll get to that part. And then the <coughs> guy, his power is that he's just he has very, the strength of very, three men. Very strong. Like, uh, yeah, basically. Three men. Very and, strong. Yep, and he's very popular. He's a sheriff at this time. Uh, is he the sheriff or the deputy? Sheriff. He's a sheriff at this time. He becomes then, king eventually. Right, then eventually he becomes the king, and, it, and as a child she was shipped off to a foreign land, and she comes back as a leader of the Vikings. We're talking Vikings. about the girl now. Yeah, the girl comes back as the leader of Vikings. Basically. Yeah, and kind of takes over the throne and then yeah, steals Drago's fire. And I'm just like, that's dumb. Right, Why right. Did you do that? Yeah, when she comes back, you think she has this huge army, but it's only like 15 people. Yeah. And like, they take over a city where you would think 100,000 people, but well, about 20,000 people probably it's live just there. like the farmers could just take up the pitchforks yeah. and be done with it. Right. So it was. It's very so, bad. It was very bad. And um, and in, like you said, very stupid at the end. It, it, the end was so unnecessary because, like, the so she was, she so they finally eventually like ended up teaming up. Um, and the so brother they, to sister. Yeah, they tried to go do something. They tried to go take back the castle from the Vikings that betrayed the um, her yeah. his sister, and then she's like, I'm just like, oh, finally, some like ah, like cool fire stuff probably gonna happen right you you messed up big time by setting everything on fire right she doesn't use it she uses it once she, doesn't, she has the fireballs the, in her hands and she and doesn't she, throw them and then like throughout the movie she's she's throwing, throwing them fire and then all of a sudden she, she just doesn't and, I'm and like, it's not because she has any feelings towards these people she just doesn't, doesn't do it do it it's like like she takes this 
like, she takes a sword, and I'm like, why? Why? Yeah, you like like you no could, part of the movie has she ever could, even saw like she was. I'm just like able to use a sword. I'm just like you could Yondu style this thing. Like it, you, you you could, <laughs> like if you've seen Guardians of the Galaxy, you just like. Yandu was beaten, like, beat an entire ship with just a tiny little arrow. And yeah. she couldn't beat people with, like, very precise fireballs. I'm right. like, you could just make a bunch of trails go everywhere and kill them. I'm like, it almost, why didn't you do anything with it? It almost felt like uh, they ran out of money and they couldn't do the special effects. <laughs> so. <laughs> it's just like, yeah. and um, she, uh, the, when uh, she, she gets shot by an arrow um, and the she gets four she gets like a forewarning like probably ten seconds before it actually releases. Yeah. She looks at the person for like that yeah. ten seconds. She wastes it staring yeah. into and her it's soul. Just a, it's just a slow motion. It's not. It's real time. It's real time. Ten. It's ten seconds. And she's of, just watching this person aim at her, and yeah, she just it's just, just, just a fireball in, in her hand. And she and doesn't do anything. I was like, oh man. So this movie. It's just like I'm just like she. It's like it's for that. It's like ten seconds of watching her mm -hmm. stare at. An arrow and be like, oh no, yeah, oh was, no, yeah. oh no, and that's ten seconds of the thing, and then she gets shot, and I'm like, right, what? I was yeah. so mad. Yeah, it was. I'm like, it was very. Yeah, the ending, and, the climactic ending was anything but climactic. Yeah, and the the heart fire, like it was an like Drago died unnecessarily because she got shot by this girl, and this girl was like, yeah, could have just been taken care of so easily. And then they make, like, a plot hole because she, like, looks back as if she's, like, regretting what she did. And then she just keeps on running. I'm like, what were you thinking of doing yeah. with this scene? Yeah. That you just put it in here for no reason. Yeah, so this is definitely something to stay away from. And that's probably about the highlights yeah, of the like, film. There's no, there's, there's no highlights. The, the lowlights. I don't think there's any really highlights uh, out of the film. And it's, like... I guess the two actors were pretty good acting. The act like there was good there was really with the good material acting. they had the thing they, they had to deal with was horrible. Yeah, the material like, they had they did good. Yeah, like with with the yeah, they I just feel like though, like they used so much of this, um like all their budget, like making this girl look really strong and then Do the they fake ran city. out they ran out of money up I guess because they did that I'm like yeah. when it actually mattered when right. she was actually doing something with it she yeah. couldn't because you, you guys could, didn't let her. You could, yeah you could tell they had very little money because they didn't have money for extras to make these armies look bigger unlike the third one you know it's a B movie but it actually had a lot it you, was a lot of people like you actually saw that these armies were kind of big and this one you know you had 10 or 15 people and even the and then the army, the uh, king sided army, the Vikings had ten or fifteen people, and the king could only miss, only could uh, mustered ten or fifteen soldiers. <laughs> yeah, it was just, and it's just like why and, and the, and this guy's powers like the uh, the guy's powers, like they're mm -hmm. pretty cool, but still like does not do much with them. Like he can throw rocks like bullets, mm -hmm. and so I'm like, well, you could just grab a sack of rocks and just carry it around. I mean, it's not going to weigh you down. You're right. really strong. And then he just he just takes a sword instead of taking rocks to the fight. I'm like, you could literally take people's heads off with that throw, and you're taking a sword? Right. So my agenda, as bad as this review is, and then times it by two, and that's about as bad as that movie. Yeah. So uh, have a great day. We'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Bye.